Good morning, morning Saints. Saints. I'm Jordan. And I'm Christina. And today is Monday, December 5th, 2022. Happy birthday over this weekend to Colin Pittman, Haley Scott, and Eva Nora Ravong. Happy birthday today to Caroline Arling, Alex Kulinane, and Nolan Miller. On the menu today in the Saints Cafe, ravioli and Bosco's. Mm. Now let's take it to Jacob with our sports. Thanks, guys. Last Friday, the boys' swim team took second in their first ever quad, placing first Braden Breyer in the 200 free, Will Fleming in the 50 free and 100 fly, and Alex Muller in diving. Way to go, boys. Wrestling had a meet last Saturday, placing first in their weight class, Dylan Elmore, and placed fifth as a team altogether. The boys' basketball team will be selling Christmas shirts this Wednesday and Thursday during lunches. The cost of the shirts is $20, and you can wear it during the St. James game on December 16th. In Saints sports this week, your girls' basketball team began the season 1-0 with a 60-50 win over a tough Lincoln prep team. Senior Kat Goodwin scored 10 points, while junior Kelsey Shank also scored 10 with 16 rebounds and 6 assists. Freshman Alex Caros scored 20 to lead the Saints with Junior Jemiah McPeterson stealing the win with seven second-half defense rebounds. The Saints are back in action tonight at St. Teresa's at 7. Tomorrow, there is a boys' swim meet at Blue Valley West at 4. Friday, there is a varsity boys' basketball game at St. Pius and a varsity wrestling tournament at 1. And finally, Saturday, another wrestling tournament at 10 and boys' swim meet at 12 at Summer Trail Middle School. Now back to you guys. Thank you, Jacob. The saint of the day today is Saint Nicholas. Saint Nicholas is the patron saint of Russia and Greece, of a number of cities, and of sailors and children, among many other groups, and was noted for his generosity. Today is the ninth day of the Jesse Tree, celebrating the Israelites and the Passover. The ornament today depicts a lamb. Moses gathers the people he orders that the lamb be sacrificed and the blood of the lamb be put on the door frames of the houses. This will be a sign to, to God to pass over the houses of the Hebrews. That night, the Hebrews ate, ate roasted lamb and unleavened bread, preparing for the journey. Egyptian houses are filled with mourning, for there was not a house without someone dead. Pharaoh, finally convinced that he cannot defeat God, lets the people go. God will always protect us, even when it seems like it might be hopeless. Remember, even if it seems like you're alone, God is always fighting for you. Saints, Christmas week is here and we have some great activities planned during lunch. Today, there will be a Christmas t Kahoot. Tomorrow, there will be Christmas Karaoke. Wednesday, pic Pictures with Santa. Thursday, the 12 days of Christmas. And Friday, hot chocolate will be served. Now for our Christmas countdowns. There are only nine more days of school left, including finals, and only 20 days until Christmas. I am so excited. Oh, yeah. Thank you for watching the Halo Morning Show. We will, be back. we will be back with more for you tomorrow. I'm Jordan. And I'm Christina. Signing off. Remember, Remember stay classy, classy saints, and embrace, embrace the moment. moment.